Hey, welcome back to more Midnight Minecraft, where I play Minecraft in the middle of the night. Let's get started here. Launch Minecraft. All right, there we go. Awesome, awesome. So what am I going to, to do today? I'm thinking maybe switch that off and uh, master volume maybe about 10% there. Let's go ahead and launch the world here and jump back into where we left off. I think this episode we're just going to continue building out the house and we'll need a whole lot of clay in order to finish up this floor here and uh, it's lagging a little bit while it loads in. Let's collect anything from our furnace area here. Let's collect all the charcoal we have. Um, all right, there we go. All right, so we have a decent amount of charcoal here. One thing we're gonna need is um, some more food. Definitely gonna need some more food. I do have a fishing rod now, so we can do some fishing, but uh, setting up a farm is going to be another priority. Um, definitely another priority for us as uh, we'll need to grow some wheat and whatnot. That's all we have access to at the moment is some wheat, but uh, but we'll want to grow the rest of that out, and, uh, and then we'll probably go on a mining excursion sometime in the future here. But let me use these nine uh, bricks I have and just finish up a little bit of this. Uh, I'm not sure I have an accounting. Oh, I only have eight bricks? Okay, let's see, is that is gonna fit? All right, awesome it is. So I have one more spot I can use. Uh, and then we'll go grab some more clay here. I might also need some more some more oak. So while we're down there, let's get some oak and some uh, clay to make some more bricks. I'm not sure how much more I'll need, but it's always good not to count and just to go uh, run into doing things. So let's head down here and start uh, start getting some clay. All right, found one vein right here, and I am destroying this terrain, but uh, maybe I'll come back later and and fix it up. We'll see how that goes. All right. Put that here, and I just created a little water vacuum. All right. I shouldn't have done that. So let's uh, get some dirt here and fill this in. Get out of here, fill that in, and then there's still. All right, now the water's calm. Okay, let's keep looking for some more clay here. All right, here's some more over here. Yeah, we, there's clay all over the place. Um, I just don't want to have to get too deep down here. That way I can mine it super quick. Dig it up, rather. Oh, awesome. So this clay patch here looks significantly larger than the ones I've been mining. So maybe they get larger as we head out to into the swamp here. And there. I'm taking advantage of a tactic we talked about in the last video where I'm uh, standing on a piece of dirt in order to mine faster and then I mine the dirt out from under me. Which, uh, it's relatively effective. So let's go collect this here. It's neat how this clay, like some of it floats and some of it just sinks to the bottom. I'm not sure what, uh, why that happens in Minecraft here, but uh, yeah. So let's see. I'm assuming that I'm going to be able to get four out of, um, yeah, yeah, so one bricks block out of four of these uh, clay tablets. So we've got 16, yeah, so 16, 32 plus 10. I'm gonna try and run with that and see if I can, uh, if that's gonna be enough for me. Let me grab some oak on the way back here, just chop down a few more trees. Uh, since my main fuel source is charcoal right now, and I'm gonna probably be doing fishing uh, in order to get some more food, uh, having that uh, some more oak just to have on the in the furnace cooking up is good, is always good. All right, let's clear this out here and continue getting some more of this. All right, I'm almost hungry enough to have my second 
helping a fish. Uh, one t one of these times I'm gonna fall into that ravine, and it's not gonna be it's not gonna be very good. But at least it's pretty close to my house. Let's see. All right, cool. Let's just go ahead and eat that fish. Uh, so this is the last of my food. Uh, so that's not uh, not very comforting, but we do have means of getting more. Uh, so we'll be doing that here. Oh, there's some more food. I see two apples. That's awesome. Um, just as I start talking about food, let's get that apple. And uh, and yeah, so that's that's gonna hold me over a little bit. I think the fish keeps me fuller for longer. I would also be um, you know fuller for longer if I had um, if I don't run all the time. But uh, you know I just feel better when I'm getting places fast. And I just spotted some coal in that cave there, which should be pretty useful for us um, as a fuel source. I feel like. Uh, all right, let's let's just do half that, and then put that in there. Then this one, maybe we'll do seven, and then over here, do another seven, and over here we'll get some of this uh, charcoal going there. All right, so all of our furnaces are going. Maybe I should invest in some more furnace action. Uh, let's go grab some more stone here, and maybe I'll. Uh, keep going with these uh, furnaces here. It seems like you can never have too many furnaces burning at once. And okay, I thought that was a drop off, maybe in the cave. But, uh, but yeah, maybe two more might be a good number. And there is some more, what is that, uh, andesite? We have some more andesite there, that's pretty good. Uh, let's place a torch down here, lighten it up a little bit. Oh yeah, we have a lot of and Oh wow, that's a lot of andesite there. Uh, so we can see what that looks like, see if we might want to invest more in uh, in our housing project looking like that andesite. I don't think I will. I think I'll just end up going with stone. Um, I'll get maybe like an iron pickaxe and just mine a bunch of stone. And, and, then, uh, and then have like a, a nice looking uh, stone arrangement uh, like I have on my house currently. And I'm referring, of course, to this uh, gray stone right here. Um, and we can get that by burning cobblestone back into regular stone and then um, and then turning it into that right there. Let's get two more of these. And then uh, we will, what is that? Wheat seeds. I thought those were originally just called seeds. But that's neat that they have a somewhat uh, new name here. So yeah, let's... Um, I do have some coal now. I only got two pieces of coal from that. But uh, what was I planning on doing? Oh, I was going to turn this andesite into polished andesite and see what it looks like. Um, let's see here. I got some new recipes and whatnot. Yeah, it's a little plain, so I'll probably just stick with uh, stick with what I have. But let's get some cobblestone cooking, and that uh, that'll make for a nice base to our house. And we got some more charcoal to fuel the fires of innovation. All right, let's just uh, get this going here. And I think, huh, what do I want to invest this iron in? That's kind of one thing I'm, I'm thinking about is uh, do I make a pickaxe or do I make, you know, a flint and steel and a sword? Uh, I, think, I think I might just go for that pickaxe. And... Um, and then we can probably venture down into the ravine and grab some iron, like right there. Um, we haven't gone into any kind of mining quests yet, but I think I will probably just invest in, uh, in a pickaxe. But uh, yeah, so let's go ahead and make that pickaxe. That'll make uh, mining some stone faster for completing our house. And one thing I might do is just uh, come back later to our um, uh, our project of. Um, building the house and completing that all up, I might just go ahead and work with, um, I like maybe go into the mine and do something else. But uh, let's, and then come back to that later at a later time. Let's see how this is going. That's going pretty well. And uh, yeah, so production there is going pretty well. Three apples, and let's make some more bricks and see if we can finish out our base with what I've harvested so far. Head out here 
and we will want to have like a nice perimeter like that. That looks pretty good. Then we head back here and just chop this. Here we got 15. I'm not counting. So we'll just chop all this out here. And the underside of a crafting table looks awfully a lot like the wood planks. So we will need some more to finish out this perimeter right here, but that looks like everything uh, we've been using bricks on so far. And I'll probably use these bricks in other places, just because they look so awesome, but for now that should be good. Let's see, so yeah, this is definitely going to be enough. Take that right there, nothing was cooking there, and then it looks like my, my charcoal is done cooking. Alright, let's uh, make... Last few bricks here should be enough to finish this. It, launcher quit unexpectedly. It seems like the launcher uh, quits and it feels the need to send me a notification about it um, every single time. That's, that's happened to me a few times now. And I did forget to consider the area right here. So it, does, it looks like I might not have enough bricks already made. I'll need two more uh, to finish this out. And I wonder, what am I going to make my little porch area out of. Um, maybe I can make it out of some birch wood or something. Um, maybe like some stone stairs and birch wood. Alright, that's enough. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, some stone stairs and birch wood might be the thing to do here. And the sun is already going down. It feels like Minecraft days go by so quick. Um, maybe that's just because I'm building and this is a little bit of a slower episode not as much as going on so let's head in and uh, and go to sleep for the night here in Minecraft uh, yeah you can see the the fish uh, that I had eaten they're they're keeping me full which is super nice uh, whereas the apples my uh, my hunger tends to start to go a lot faster uh, when, I'm, when I'm eating the apples it's a lot sooner that I get hungry again so, um, what are we going to do here? I think I'm going to go grab some birch wood and finish up maybe a porch area, a little bit of a porch area. And we could make a roof to make this look a little bit better, uh, but another thing I'll need is like some cobblestone. I'll probably finish out the basement before putting a roof on my structure. Uh, another reason to not put a roof on at the moment is that the structure might get a little bit taller. I'm thinking I'll just leave it as it is, but uh, who knows, maybe I'll decide to make it a bit taller. Oh, that looks nice. Oh, okay. Did I just... What is this? Stripped birch... Oh, I, I think I accidentally um, right-clicked on the birch wood, which did that. Um, stripped wood. What, is that, what does that look like? That might be, that might be a neat look. Um, hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure where I would use that, but, uh, but that's neat. I forgot you could do that, where you could strip the the bark off of the tree. Uh, so this is probably enough, just how much I've harvested so far. I'm just going to harvest a little bit more, and, and this tree should be good to go. Um, just Yeah, that's, that's probably enough. So let's head out of here and head back over. And I do see some more fish over here in the river, so let's go fishing. I know I don't have my fishing pole, um, but uh, we could do this the old-fashioned way. I love so much how this works with fishing, with a sword, this would totally not work in, um, of course, in the real world, the fish would get scared and, uh, and they'd be off, but um, if you jumped into the water with a sword, um, they wouldn't recognize a the sword, they would just you know, recognize the commotion, of course, but, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, one thing I should do, just while I'm right here, is grab some sand and possibly cause, cause an avalanche because I'm right here next to a cave. And there goes my shovel. But that is enough sand to get us a lot of glass panes uh, that I can use to, uh, to make some windows on my house here. And there's some more coal, which is nice. We'll have to go on a mining expedition in uh, an upcoming episode here and uh, get a whole lot of cobblestone to finish out the base of my house, as well as gather a bunch of resources. And we're out of coal here. Let's just fill that up. Alright, and we're out of coal here too. Alright. Great. So, 
we'll finish up making all of our bricks there. And let's complete this area right here a little bit more. And I might have some extra leftover bricks or enough leftover bricks that I can just use those on uh, to build out a little step, a little porch. And one thing I'll do now that I have a little more dirt is fill this in. There we go. Fill that in a little more. Nope, that's not what I want to do. Fill this in here. That's pretty good. All right, there we go. Clear some grass out of here, and this gives me enough room to kind of walk up. I've been kind of um, moseying around here, or uh, really having to watch my step while climbing up uh, to my my porch here. But now I should be able to uh, to make the step a bit easier. Let's build this out. So I have a little bit of a flat entrance, maybe maybe two bricks out. Let's get my birch out here. I'm thinking, I don't, I don't think I'll end up using this um, right here, that look. Now I don't like that as much, but uh, can I turn this into planks still? I can. Okay. So these are these these work the same way. Um, let me let me see how that that makes sense. Um, how do I want to do this? I could, you know, maybe put my birch right there. That's not um, maybe like a pillar right here and then some steps coming down or I could put it maybe like right up against the house um, wondering what the best way here is maybe just yeah the way I have it going right now like that might be a pretty good way to go so if I build this like that I'll do one two I think that's gonna look pretty good and then we'll want to build some steps I wonder if I have enough yeah, I probably have enough brick to just build some, build out some brick steps. Oh, what was that? Oh, F. We'll have uh, the item go to my other hand there. That's pretty neat. Um, and then, how do I want to do this? Maybe if it's like lined with birch. I don't know if that's if that would be a good look. If it kind of looks something like that, and then I had a stair, stair. We'll see how this looks. Um, let me get some dirt here to pile up to my house for the moment, and then I'll go make some possibly some brick stairs. Um, see, get some scaffolding to get up to my house here. All right. Enter right there. Collect the remaining bricks. I think there was some in here. Twenty-eight. Hmm. Yeah, maybe I'll have to end up getting some more of this. But fourteen is that going to be enough for what I'm doing? How much does it take? It's it's that to uh, see. Hmm. Let's make one of these and see if four stairs will be enough. I'm cutting it a little close, and I could always go get more, but um, yeah, four is definitely not gonna be enough if I do it like this. I guess I could also do a little pattern, uh, maybe with some oak planks or whatnot, but. Um, what I was thinking is I could have something like what if I what if I cut oops, what if I cut this area here away and then started my stairs right here? How would that look? Like that. That's probably pretty good if I just do it like that. That does give me a few more bricks to work with. Um, and then I'll need six more of these so let's go make six sadly i'll have to it's it's not very even for me so i'll have to do two sets which means i definitely will need to do some more harvesting of clay here um, yeah, there we go. so let us see and then maybe we'll do yeah so if, if i'm going to go harvest some more clay it's probably fine to just build this entire thing out with bricks. Um, meaning like, you know, we'll just go here and here, and then we'll build um, build down from there. Like one, two, three, and then one, two, and we'll need to go get some more bricks to fill that in, but then we'll do like that. Kind of a brick staircase to head up to our house. 
Um, and that looks fine, at least for now. That looks um, looks fine. So let's go collect some more bricks. We don't need too much more. And actually, before I head out here, let me make a shovel. Uh, that's what I'll need to collect my my bricks. And of course, I don't have any stone because I turned it all into this nice looking stone here. So let me go collect some more cobblestone. Once we go on at least one mining expedition, uh, this is going to be a lot easier to uh, just to get a whole lot of this stone here. And there we go. Like so we'll eventually fill in the whole base like this with this stone brick. And I think that looks, that looks uh, fine. I'm pretty much just making a collage of all the different types of uh, materials in Minecraft uh, for my house here, or at least for my, my shack for the moment. Um, let me see, what was I going to do here? Build a shovel real quick, a stone shovel. That'll help me collect some clay. And we will be right back to finish up my... I should make a, a smoother drop right there. But to finish up my house, we'll be right back. And you can see the wheat is maturing. We definitely have enough wheat now to build some bread. Or to build some bread, to uh, to craft some bread. I guess we do it in a crafting table, but uh, we don't really do that part in the furnace. Um, so we're not baking the bread exactly, but... Uh, we are crafting bread. So, how much of this do I have now? Um, 52, that, that's enough. 52 is definitely enough. Um, so we'll be back to that wheat farm there. And uh, maybe we'll do that here in one of these uh, upcoming episodes to get my wheat farm going. Um, but uh, I think we'll end up going on a mining expedition first here. Uh, let's see, get some of this going here. And then some of that going there. Finish up our brick production there, and yeah, awesome, awesome. So we will need just one more brick block and then one more stair block. Oh, that's probably pretty good. And for the area here, I'd like to be able to come up to the stairs at maybe like an angle. So I'm probably going to remove this block I have there. What am I going to do instead then? And I just fell into the cave. Yeah, we'll want to do a little terraforming there, but um, but that's actually probably fine as it is. Um, maybe if I try and get creative with these fence posts or something, I don't know. Um, maybe we can make something work here. Um, yeah, I don't know. And we keep falling into the little pit here. Yeah, I don't know. Like, uh, we can we could probably come up with um, with something to do right here. Uh, I'm not sure if, if what I have designed right here is it, but uh, yeah, see. it's probably fine to have it. And we're doing it again, of course. Um, it's probably fine to have just you know one right there. That doesn't look too bad. And um, put that there, and then I don't know. Just put this here for now, tentatively. All right, so now let's head in here and collect my bricks. And there we go. Let's make some stuff out of these bricks. All right, let's see. Put that back. Put this here. And I don't have enough to do the stairs. Let's get these bricks as they come off the press. We'll need, should just be one more. Um, Oh, th this is going to make one brick, yeah. So we'll need uh, two more um, sets right there. Let's go to sleep for now. I'm actually going to let some mobs start to spawn here. And we have some, what, what are those called, pillagers over there? That is an unpleasant sight, absolutely an unpleasant sight. Uh, those guys are super, super aggressive, super violent, and we've been mostly um, just hanging out. And they are not going away, are they? Yeah, so we might have to come up with some sort of creative strategy to get rid of those guys, but um, I'm not sure if there's a great way to to get rid of them uh, without just you know killing them off and then um, and uh, drinking some some cow's milk there to make their little curse go away. All right, let's. Uh, we have enough now to finish up my stair project. Hopefully, we can finish this up before the pillagers see us and come on over here uninvited. Um, Let's head over here, start that fish cooking. Uh, let's see, they don't see me yet, so let's just finish up my little stair project. 
right, uh, right here. Let's get our last brick here and then right there. All right, awesome. So our stair project is pretty much finished up. I don't think those pillagers are going to despawn, so maybe in the next episode we'll do something. Maybe we'll take on the pillagers and go mining, or um, uh, we'll see uh, what we end up doing. We'll definitely need to go mining to get a lot more stone to finish up the base of our house. And uh, what else should we do? Um, after that, we'll get the farm going and whatnot to get a more sustainable food source than just finding some fish spontaneously in the river. So, yeah, I guess that's probably... Yeah, that's about um, all the time I have for this episode here. But yeah, this has been Will Middleton. Thanks for joining me, and I'll see you in the next video.